Multicultural Spotlight, presented by Chevrolet. Find new roads. In your multicultural spotlight, more women are answering a growing demand for CDL drivers. In fact, the biggest influx came in the middle of the COVID-19 pandemic. Experts tell multicultural reporter Katira Winfrey that equal pay and work flexibility are key recruitment factors. Heading south on Harding Street, you'll see plenty big trucks and for hire signs, telltale signs that the truck industry is booming. And advocates say as more women look to find job stability, this may be the route to take. One year ago, Nye Riddle worked as a designer. Today, she's taken quite the detour as an over-the-road truck driver. Her latest load, nearly 80,000 pounds. It just really hit me. I was like, you know what? I, I think I want to try trucking. For this Indianapolis native, her passion for semis began as a child, but she never latched on until now. I do no touch freight. Um, which means like I don't I just back to a doc. She's gone through multiple weeks of training and months of on the job experience to get her where she is this morning, Ohio, now Georgia. Tomorrow, somewhere new. Once my mind is made up on something, I'm going for it. It's a decision countless women continue to make. Ellen Voye founded the nonprofit Women in Trucking Association 15 years ago. It's a slow process, but women now make up about 14% of over the road drivers. The biggest image problem that we have is that women don't picture themselves in the trucking industry. They don't look at a truck and go, oh, there's a job for me. The technology improvement and pay equity have delivered more women to the field. Boy says this can be a great paying career. Companies pay based on the mile, the hour, or size of the load. It doesn't matter who's driving it. Really surprised at how many women are coming in who are nurses or nurses aides or work in nursing homes. So the pandemic has been beneficial. Boy and Riddle say if this is the path you want to take, just go for it. I also had people in my corner as well, but it was it was a lot of naysayers. Other agencies are offering additional support for women when it comes to recruiting and funding for training. Reporting in Indianapolis, Katira Winfrey, Wish TV, WishTV.com, and follow us on Facebook.